Well, Brad, we wondered if the CBS2 investigators have been uncovering these wrong police raids for two years, lots of raids. Why are the aldermen just now speaking out? In the last two years, the CBS2 investigators have uncovered dozens of botched police raids. Cops searching for suspects at the wrong addresses, knocking down doors, guns in hand, scaring parents and children alike. The CBS2 investigators have aired 50 of these stories. But it was this case that CBS2 broke. The raid at Anjan at Young's home, the innocent social worker naked facing cops with guns drawn, that's moved the city council's black caucus to demand reforms. And this was just something that uh, was the proverbial straw that broke the camel's back. The Alderman want police body cam video released quickly, more civilian oversight of the police department and abolishing the use of warrants based solely on informants. We also apologize sincerely to Ms. Anjanette Young for the experiences um, that she suffered in 2019. The caucus demands accountability from the mayor's office and the police department, but we wonder, what about the aldermen? Dozens of cases over the last uh, two years. Why this action now? Why not a year ago, a year and a half ago? Uh, actions could have been taken earlier, but uh, we are here now and we will uh, do the legislative fixes that need to be done. Chicago taxpayers take a big hit in police misconduct cases. $58 million paid out last year alone. Now the Black Caucus wants a new city council committee to examine those settlements. Brad? Critical questions there, Jim, to all involved. What has taken so long? Uh, the city council's finance committee is responsible for approving settlements in police misconduct cases. Why do the aldermen want a new committee? Brad, they say the workload is enormous to get to the bottom of the settlements, to find out why the settlements have to be paid and problems with the police department. And they say there should be a city council committee with that sole focus. Okay, Jim Williams, thank you.